I was definitely surprised. Um, I was having a lot of fun in Arizona, uh, just practicing and getting used to being there. And it was a good time. And then when I got the call, I was pretty surprised. Have you been told yet at all how you might be used here or what your expectations are? Not yet, no. I'm just going to go to practice and try to be the best I can and get better every single day I step on the ice. Does this feel like a good opportunity for you, though? A good, good chance to get a steady job or whatnot? <clears throat> Oh, for sure, I'm excited about the opportunity, excited to uh, go out there and hopefully play some games. Do you know anybody in this room before coming here? I knew a couple guys and it was a lot of fun seeing some smaller faces. Yeah, who'd you know? Oh, I knew Dales, uh, Bowie, a couple different guys here just from playing World Juniors and different tournaments, stuff like that. Yeah. Did any of them call you as soon as they found out? Or? No, because I was here within a couple hours of finding out, so I got here pretty <laughs> quickly, so they didn't have any time to do that. Yeah, how did all that unfold for you? It was pretty quick. I found out at 9 a.m. and I was on a flight at 1.40, so it was uh, pretty exciting times. You were 4-0 uh, uh, start you two seasons this year. Just talk about how your season had been going up to this point. It was kind of a weird season, not getting picked up off waivers by Arizona and uh, not really playing any games. And then they sent me down a conditioning stint and uh, got to play in four games, which is a lot of help for me. What kind of style of goalie are you? Um, I think as a positional goalie, tries to get in the way and uh, just uh, make the game as calm as they can. Did you have a favorite player growing up? Mario Ritter for a while, and then became Carey Price when he won the World Junior Gold Medal for Canada. So I think that was pretty much everybody in Canada's favorite goal. <laughs>